Radio, let's set up auto discovery of these two. So I've set up Node Exporter on CentOS 7. It's virtually the same as I set it up on Ubuntu 18, except I had to open port 9100. So let's um, set up the discovery. So on the Zabbix, I'm just going to remove that host that I created in the last video. Delete that altogether. Okay, I'll also delete this Ubuntu 18 Zabbix agent host and also my CentOS one as well so that we don't have any confusion and okay so i've also stopped the agent on the ubuntu and i've also stopped the agent on the centos discovery and i'm going to disable this discovery rule with let's create a new discovery rule i'm going to call it discover prometheus node exporters Going to use the Raspberry Pi. The range on my network is that. Update interval one hour checks. HTTP 9100. There could be anything listening on port 9100, but I'm just going to presume that it's a node exporter. Add. Okay, HTTP 9100. I'm going to leave everything else as default enabled add okay so there we go discover prometheus node exporters let's create an action I'm going to disable all these actions create a new action add a prometheus linux host the discovery rule equals Prometheus node exporters add a discovery rule equals Prometheus node exporters operations let's add add to host group Linux servers add another one link to template operating systems from add add now this is a very simple just catch all for anything on port 9100 it's going to be put into the add to host groups linux servers and being given a template template os linux by prom but let's look at monitoring discovery and i'll let you know how it goes well here's an update it has found those two hosts the centos 7 vm and the ubuntu 18 vm and let's have a look at one of them Okay, so let's put it into discovered hosts, Linux servers, and it's assigned a template, template OS Linux by prom. It has given it an IP address, a DNS name, and it put it under agent interfaces, like what happened when I did it manually. Um, there is no agent running on this server, monitored by Raspberry Pi. So that's all good. So let's have a look at its items. All items are enabled still. There's plenty of triggers. There are a few graphs. And there's three discovery rules which are still running, I'm sure. If I go down to monitoring latest data and apply, still don't see any values showing up just yet, but I'll keep an eye on that. And let you know when data comes through okay so we're getting some data now down here system description 
CentOS 7 VM Ubuntu 18. Here we go. And let's have a look at the history. Oh, this is the the response from the metrics. Linode exporter. The metrics, here it is. Anyway, this took roughly about, let's have a look, monitoring discovery, one hour fifty-two. It was actually discovered about half an hour after I discovered it, so it's about two and a half hours. Now, because these are running behind a proxy, and there are several phases involved with discovery, any changes happening on the server won't make it down to the proxy right away. So, so sometimes you might want to try a config cache reload like that, just to speed it up a little. Okay, so what we did then was installed a couple of node exporters just the prometheus node exporters themselves we don't need prometheus because uh, zabbix server is our front end for the exporters one thing to note though the node exporters don't come with the ability to add ssl or authentication so if you install one on the on a publicly accessible server, you should restrict the firewall ports to just the Zabbix server or the proxy, whichever you want. And the for SSL, because the message is unencrypted, you'll have to come up with something else like a secure tunnel. Excellent. So anyway, it's been running for a little while now, and look, we're starting to see some really good information come through. Let's put that down to half an hour. That's the interface, network traffic, and disk average waiting time. Read writes, utilization and queue. And on the CentOS, same thing. I mean, the, the Prometheus node exporter is pretty good in terms of data. Okay, excellent.